Hello world, it's John from Sparkbox once again to talk about automated accessibility testing. This video is part of a series on how to help improve the accessibility of your site with automated testing. In the previous videos, we talked about two tools, Axe, which is a tool to help you identify accessibility issues on your site, and Cypress, which is an automated testing tool that allows you to test your site from the perspective of a user. If you're not familiar with either of these tools, you may want to check out the previous videos. Okay, let's talk about how to use Cypress to test the pages of your site with Axe. So shout out to this gentleman here, Andy Vanslars, who I've never met. So Andy, if you happen to see this, I apologize if I pronounced your name wrong, but thank you for creating the glue to bring Cypress and Axe together. So Andy has created a plugin for Cypress called Cypress Axe, which allows you to inject Axe Core into your Cypress tests. So Cypress Axe is available on GitHub and can be installed with NPM. So let's take a look at how to use it in your Cypress tests. So Cypress automatically creates a support file at Cypress slash support slash index. This file will run before every single test file and we can import Cypress Axe here so that it's available for all of our tests. When we import this file, it adds some additional commands to the Cy object that we can use in our tests. So here we have an accessibility test. We start by visiting the home page, and now Cypress Axe has provided this method so that we can inject Axe into the page after it's loaded. After we've injected Axe into the page that we want to test, we can call the check ally command that Cypress Axe has added, and that will test the accessibility of our page. So if we go ahead and run that test, we can see that it's loaded our page, and after running Axe, it's identified some accessibility errors. If we hover over the individual errors, we can see that it highlights the identified elements for each issue. Now, we don't see as much helpful information as we do with the Axe browser plugin, but if we open up the console and the DevTools, we'll see that for each error, Cypress Axe logs some additional information about the error. So it identifies the impact level of the error, in this case, Sirius. It shows a description of the error along with a hint to help fix the error. And it gives us this help URL that will take us to a page to learn more information about the error. So now we're able to automate our Axe tests and see any resulting accessibility issues in Cypress. We also have the ability to add new tests for all of the pages across our site. In the next video, we'll look at how we can extend Cypress Axe to customize the reporting of our accessibility errors and add additional information. See you then. Thanks for watching.